her marriage was a big struggle from the start. Correct, madam? Why was it caste, race, religion? Caste. Caste. What caste are you, madam? I am a Gujarati. He is a Gujarati, but different surnames. Can you imagine? Mm. Both Gujarati, but different surnames. And this can create a lot of problem. We don't want that woman into the house. Why you marry her? Get out. Correct, madam. Exactly. And now this would have resorted to a lot of dark energy and all, madam. My sister-in-law, my hmm. my husband's brother's wife, last year she called me and she said, you are still not accepted in this family. It's Can you imagine? 27 years. 27 years. Is That's what, what she told What me. kind of nonsense is it? Now, when India can get rid of all of this, then India will prosper in a very different way, madam. Yes or not, madam? Yes. Exactly. Very sad, madam. Very sad. It goes on everywhere. This is one case, madam. What if they are married among other religion? <laughs> I don't a Hindu marry a Muslim or Muslim marry a Hindu. Can you imagine the kind of problem they're going to have for the rest of their life? They cannot be together, madam. They'll be struggling and struggling and end up in divorce. That's called an endangered species. Exactly, sir. They're endangered forever. They cannot be in peace. They cannot be in peace. Today, madam, somebody called me up, a lady. Now, married for eight years. She's a Hindu. He's a Muslim. They got eight-year-old child. Everything fine. They accepted. They're living together. Now, the man should be a Muslim. I don't care. But the very beginning is very fine. Very, very smart. I accept you. I accept you. All fine. But over the ten years, what's going to happen? Now, they're going for divorce. And she's crying, madam. What will she do? He's forcing her to be a Muslim. Yeah. Something so, is stopping some kind of force to... For me to go close to my husband. Yes, madam. You got blocks. You got children, madam? Two. Twenty-two-year-old. Lord, man. madam. Lord, the blocks. They wanted to break up, madam, even before the marriage. I know. Not I mean, even before, yeah? One, two, three, four, five months before the marriage, already black magic already started. Not now. Hmm? <laughs> They have done, madam. Hmm? They have done. They have practically go and do somewhere and say this thing must break up. She's got first level, second level, third level, fourth level, fifth level black magic. Queen, first level, second level, third level, sixth level black magic. You all, first level, second level, third level black magic. The name and levels of black magic. Which one is ours? Hmm? Which one is ours? I told you what. Eight level black magic, madam. You're super smart. You're super fantastic. <laughs> How many people are involved in it? What do you want to do now? <laughs> I know, I know, but Sir, just go back and read forgiveness. Page number seven. To whomever who's not happy with me and my family and our work. Just do that, sir. Don't have to go and investigate and find out. It's not going to help but you in any way. Doing it or is it so you keep reading, madam. Every day? How many? No, no. I mean, saying they mm. keep doing the magic? Or is yes, it? madam. They will keep doing, madam. Like her, they will keep on doing. Understand? So you have to protect yourself. What about mom? Yes, yeah, they'll keep on doing. It's all family issues. How many times we should be? Madam, you will read for the rest of your life, madam. Three times. Three. Now, the other way of solving this problem is getting the calendar. Hmm? We sell the calendars. I'm very sorry. We used to give them free, but now we can't afford to give because we have about we last year we made eighteen thousand calendars. So it's money for us, and the proceed from these uh, calendars will go for our travel around the world. Now every month, four times, you have to sit down in front of the calendar and we remove the black magic. Every full moon, new moon, and half moon. But you have to follow this protocol. <coughs> protocol. Hold the game, brother. Hmm? This is protocol you have to follow. Page one to page seven. This is all about nature beings. The half moon is only for black magic removal. What we do is the month of January. It's about the sun. We bless the sun. We thank the sun for whatever we get is left. In the month of February is the Mother Earth. Okay. In the month of March is the moon. This is nature. We need nature, madam. Otherwise, we are not going to survive in this world. We are doing so much harm. 
Okay. Next is rain. Do we need the rain? Yes. Does California need the rain? Yes. yes. Why you need the rain? To put the fire off. Mm. Fire keeps on burning here. It doesn't burn for one day. It just keeps on burning and burn all the jungle. Yeah. Yes or no? Yes. You need the rain. If the land is wet, there will not be so much fire. Exactly. Next, you need the money. Do you need money, madam? Yes. We all need money. So this money, you bless the money, must allow the money to come into your life. Next, we have got trees. Do you need trees? Yes. 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 Where are the biggest trees in the world? Amazon. In California. California. Oh. The Redwood Forest. How big are the trees? Redwood Forest. Sequoia. Nowhere in the world they are here. Only in California. In Seattle. Sequoia. 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 Seattle. Sequoia. I, I've, Sequoia. Gone, I've been there before. It's California, but not in not in San Francisco. Right? It's Sequoia up north. Yes. I think home, I went there from Seattle. I went from Seattle or here. I went. I can't remember. I took a I took a tour and they took me there. Went huge, huge trees. Yes, we need them. Why do you need trees? Air. They give us oxygen. Rejuvenate. And they take the carbon. They are the biggest purifier. When Amazon was burned, twenty percent of forest they give oxygen. Mother is just missing now. That's all. Hmm? Next. Animals. In the month of July, in the month of July, all the Muslims will sacrifice millions and millions of goats, yeah. cows, in the month of July. We just sacrifice them. So we put for the month to memorize them that animals are sacrificed for no reason. no reason. Whatever they believe is so sad. Okay? This one is for the water. Do you want water to come into our house? Yes. Yes, we bless the water. Don't take for granted water, water, water. You go to some places, there's no water matter. You go to India, you know how difficult water they are digging 900 meters and there's no more water there. It's all finished. They're digging, but people cannot even land. They cannot even land. Farmers are committing suicide in India because they cannot pay the government loan. The bank, they cannot pay. You know they're committing suicide. Hmm? Last time I had a workshop in Dallas. Hmm? The Indians are making an Aksha down in New World. Can you imagine, madam? Why? You're so lucky, you come here, you have so good life, you got good cars and good houses. The Indians are struggling and committing suicide. If every family can give $1,000 to help one family to pay the debt, and they'll be debt free. But they're committing suicide, madam. Yes or no, madam? $1,000 US dollars only, madam, to one family. Why can't you have make a charity <laughs> thing and have an NGO? Uh, and go down there and see who are the people who pay them for 1,000 years. Maybe the money will be gone. They are not taking close and close of loans, sir. They are all just farmers in the villages. 1,000 US, 1,500 US, 2,000. That's all you have to do. Not close and close like big, big guys. Small, small money on this side. Just for land. And there's no water, they cannot survive the land. They cannot pay the money. They commit suicide. Hmm? And this is for the mountains, the volcanoes. They are part of Mother Earth. We bless them. And then, ocean. Where's the water going to come from to the America? Where's the water going to come from, sir? Rivers. From the ocean. Yeah. It's the biggest giver of water for all of mankind. So you must bless the ocean. Hmm? You eat fish? Now we go eat fish. You eat fish, madam? Who eats fish? Hmm. You eat fish, huh? You eat fish, huh? How many fish you eat today? From the day you're born, how many fish have you eaten? Hmm. Yeah, how much? How many fish you how many fish have you eaten? You number? Didn't count no, just count. Just give an estimate. Mm -hmm. hundred fish? Yeah, probably a couple hundred. Did you put two fish back in the ocean? Yeah. Exactly. We fill here. Who's going to put it back? You eat fish. Never mind. We eat five fish. Take hundred fish, baby fish, and put it inside. We don't do that, madam. We finish, finish, finish. If only all the fishermen would stop fishing on Saturday and Sunday, you know how much the ocean will grow? No fishing on Saturday and Sunday. Every day, every week, like holiday for the ocean. You know how much fish will grow, madam? Yes or no? Yes. Lord, look at this. These are the clouds. We need the clouds. We need the wind to bring the, the, the water from the ocean back to the land. We need the mountain. We need the whole cycle, madam. And finally, where the yeah. water comes from? From Bora Bodo in Indonesia. So remember this, eh? So if you want to remove your black magic, or if you think you have black magic, every full moon, half moon, you need to buy madam because this will keep on coming to you. Yeah. Hmm? Until you get out from the family. <laughs> no, you have a choice, madam. Get out from the family. No. 
Oh, start the being black magic baby. Okay, pulpit number 7. Okay.